What's up, everybody? Welcome for the first time. We're back to another DLJ Works video. Not going to waste any time talking. This video is going to show you how to export any timeline animation, whether it be your traditional tween animation or a frame by frame animation. Um, this is going to show you how to export it as a GIF. And in other videos, I showed you how to turn it into Rosetta export videos, but this is for the GIF. So without further ado, let's get started. So here I have a GIF. All right, and this is going to actually be a plain white GIF, so you can barely see this. So what I'm going to do is, so you can actually see this plain, I'm going to turn off the effects so you can see the actual um, gentleman I have running across the screen here frame by frame. We're going to just simply export this as a GIF. Okay. I'm going to stop it right there. So the way that we do that is we're going to go to, and this is done on a Mac, by the way. So uh, this may be the same for a PC, I'm not sure, but if you're a Mac user and most graphic users are, this is how you're going to do it. We're going to go to File. We're simply going to go to Export, and then we're going to go to Save for Legacy, Save for Web Legacy. Now, it used to be that you can go to Export As, and if you go to GIF, nothing happens. You're just going to export a still image. So don't do this. Do not do this at all. We're going to simply go back to um save for legacy web and i'm going to play my gif make sure that it's selected as gif here uh preset uh you could choose i like to choose gif uh, dithered so uh let's go ahead and let's do that and then we're going to hit play make sure your looping options wherever you want it to be once forever i'm gonna leave it on forever because i'm gonna use it for it anyway i'm gonna hit play to make sure that this is working and we have our gif working as it needs to so then i'm going to hit save all right, and I'm going to put this, I'll just put it in the downloads folder here. Wells running gift. Um, I'm going to hit replace because I already had a file name. Let's pull this up in a preview to see if this worked out well for us. And it did, it worked out perfectly. All right, so that is how you export your animation as a gift. That is going to be it for this video. If there's something that you feel like I left out that is super difficult in doing this, please let me know in the comments and maybe buy me a coffee. Maybe uh, slide me a little change, spare change or whatnot if you found this video helpful. Any other Photoshop difficulties um, with these updates to the 22 version of this um, program. All right, talk to you guys soon. God bless y'all and I will see you in the next video.